In this tutorial, we'll look at how to display pre-processed and stacked pre stack gases in OpenDetect. We'll also have a look at how to apply automatic gain control before and after stacking the seismic data. First, we'll display stack data from the SEC SALT model on an inline. It is also possible to display in a 3D scene the first offset trace of each CDP using the proxies and a curly bracket at the end of the list. The right-click menu on that inline enables the selection of loaded pre-stack data using the option Display PS Gather. The pre-stack display will be a plane perpendicular to the displayed element inline or crossline at the location of the mouse. In interact mode, it is very quick to browse through the CDPs with the mouse left-click. The appearance of the gather can be modified by defining the following properties. The shape of the plane, its appearance, color table and grid lines, scaling, and pre-processing. The pre-processing tab lists a number of pre-processing methods that will be applied to the pre-stack data. First, a mute will be added and a mute definition must be selected in the mute properties. Then, automatic gain control is added and the window width is adjusted in the AGC setup window. The pre-processing is rendered in pressing apply or OK. You'll first apply it and then save it for later use. The vertical stack option can be used to create super gases by stacking the pre-stack traces inline or crossline wise. The pre-stack processing chain remains in memory. Moving to another location will automatically pre-process the gather at a new location, like for attributes. Pre-processing is not only used for displaying the gathers. The processing may be applied to store on disk the processed pre-stack data or to restack the data. To compute and store a pre-stack processing chain, go to Processing, Create Volume Output, Pre-stack Processing. The previously saved setup and input pre-stack data must be selected and a new output name must be provided. The creation of fuel offset stacks and partial stacks is done using the so-called pre-stack attribute. This attribute will collect data from a pre-stack data store and either output statistics or perform AVO extraction from the gathers. Pre-stack processing may be applied if necessary but is not mandatory based on the application and data quality. The offset range will limit the amount of collected data, therefore using the offset range 200-1500 meters with the output average will output a near stack. The calculation type least square enables the extraction of AVO attributes such that intercept and gradient. Both the near stack and intercept attributes are now applied on the inline. Automatic gain control may also be applied on post stack data. This processing method is available in the basic attribute scaling using the third type AGC. It will be run in the user defined window by applying the attribute either on the fly or on batch. The attributes may now be processed on disk by selecting the corresponding attribute in the Create Volume Attribute window. This concludes this tutorial on pre-stack and AGC processing in OpenDetect.